me that it's all my fault It would've been perfect all along It would've been right and not another wrong And it would be a happy, not a sad song Oh, cause it's all Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Farfitch here, back with a brand new YouTube video on my channel. I've, I've never done my intro like that, I usually just say back with a brand new YouTube video. Yeah guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a new stretch resolution that has came about. And when I say stretch resolution, I mean like a different resolution. I don't mean completely 100% normal, well what everyone would deem a stretch resolution. So like 1600 by 1080 where it looks good or 1444 by 1080 or 1080 by 1080 none of that like old stuff right that doesn't look good anymore you guys know that it really decreases your fov when you use a higher um, stretch rest so if you try to use 1080 by 1080 now you'd either get really bad black bars or your fov would be like insanely close so you couldn't play the game it'll be unplayable because you'd have like an fov of 20. And the native FOV on Fortnite, the FOV, like native field of view, is actually 80. And um, basically using, like this right now, as you guys can see, this is 1656 by 1080. And this right here decreases your FOV by 10. I'm pretty sure, no, it's, it's by 10 or 20. So like, when you're using this, you're using about, like, I don't know, around 70 to 60 FOV, which is not good, because native is 80, and obviously anything below 80, like obviously you're losing FOV. Field of view is not good to lose. Obviously this does give you like the nostalgia, and like the whole, the whole feeling of stretch resolution that's why a lot of pros use this martos in particular martos really um phase martos really got this uh, out there a bit the 1650 1656 by 1080 resolution i did make a full video about it like crediting martos and he he brought this out here he uses this resolution it's a nostalgia the feeling of stretch resolution increases like the, the horizontal width of character models makes them wider makes them larger it basically improves your aim that's what it does it improves your aim also improves your fps believe it or not and does feel slightly smoother i mean it's just one of them it's more placebo i think i'll show you guys what this looks like as it is this is 1656 by 1080 like if i go here um window full screen it says 1656 by 1080 um so yeah i'll learn to creative and show you this this video isn't based on this resolution at all though this video is about a completely different resolution i'll get into that in a second and i'll show you guys that basically i'm doing this to compare the difference because as much as it's like the only other playable resolution or at least what people think um besides native this actually um this, there's a better resolution than this so guys, this is um, what 1656 by um, 1080 looks like. You know, basically you get like, I think it's like minus 20 FOV, I'm pretty sure. Something like that, I think it's about minus 20. So you do lose 20 FOV, so you're playing at about, um, you're playing at about 60 FOV, or at least, I think around 65, I think. I'm not too sure. There's not like, the, the drop in FOV isn't that big at all, compared to native. But your character model is clearly a lot wider, you guys can see um, by this little um, hot bar right here at the bottom, where you guys can see the weapons. Um, you guys can clearly see it stretched, like you can just just see off the get-go you can see that this is really stretched and stretches in horizontal stretch i mean this it does increase your fps i think i i am peaking about three 300 ish i don't know my fps it just varies a lot anyway always above 250 though in creative when i use this so yeah it does slightly improve fps i mean in terms of building like uh i, I don't know it's it it's okay it's not like it's not like an insane um resolution at all i have made a full video on this one right here this resolution so if you guys do want to use this one you can um like i'll link the video for the for this resolution in the in the description down below so you guys can uh, use this one if you want it but i, I will um, the point of this video is to show you guys another one so yeah i'll get into that right now and i'll switch over to my desktop but yeah guys overall this resolution doesn't like feel bad at all two hours later Okay guys, so as you can see, we're over my desktop right now. Um, you guys can see I do have a stretch resolution on. Um, you guys can see it right here, the, the, the display is stretched. So yeah, as I did say, this is 1656 by 1080. And yeah, what I'm going to be doing is right now just showing you guys um, how to use a better resolution than 1656. So yeah, I'm going to show you how to put it on. And then basically, I'm going to go f go online, show you guys what it looks like. And also explain why this is like a lot better. Also guys, um, I'm going to say, um, I ain't going to like take credit for this like, at all, like one bit. But um, full credit goes to this guy right here, Faze Vorven or Vorwen. I'm not really sure how you say it. But this guy, yeah, he literally plays like he's a full Fortnite player, professional player for FaZe. He's um, an insane player. He has 45,000 subscribers. And two hours ago, um, probably about four hours ago when I uploaded this video. But yeah, it's only got 3,000 views so far. And he made this video about the resolution. Like, as you guys can see, he made a whole video about this resolution right here. And that's what I'm going to be showing you guys in this video. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to credit him. Like, this isn't me just taking this video idea. Like, I mean, it's sort of is in a way. 
but the point of you like spread it like it's like a news channel i'm spreading um stuff that's like good like um will benefit you guys because obviously not everyone's going to be subscribed to this guy i i have a, i have a different fan base to him so um yeah i'm just reaching reaching pushing that a little bit further you know so you guys can also ex like enjoy this resolution because not everyone's going to see this video from him he will be linked down below by the way okay so yeah you did just see that the resolution is 1750 by 1080 and i'm going to show you how you, got, how you put it on it's like putting any um resolution on, like the old way so but also how you put the 1656 one on so yeah you want to go to your um taskbar right here the little bottom bit and just do percent app data percent and um sorry i said you put percent data five yeah percent app data percent right and then it should say file folder and you just click this folder right here but if it does not show the folder when you type that in, just type run. Just do this. Like I say you just do this anyway. Type run like this. And it will say run application like this. Click that. And then right here, percent, abdata, percent. Press OK. And it will open this folder right here. Once you guys are here, you want to go back and click this bit here that says abdata. Go to local. Go down to where it says Fortnite game. Press saved. Config. And then um, where it says Windows client. Double click this. Then you have these folders right here. Where it says game user settings. You don't click it yet. Um, right click it. Press properties. And on the general tab right here on the properties, make sure where it says attributes, make sure read only is unticked where you make the changes. It may be ticked, I don't know. Um, if you never change the resolution before, it won't be ticked. But make sure you check this and um, just make sure it's unticked. So then once you did that, press apply, press OK, then you can double click to open it. So we're just going to open right here. Open my other monitor just there, but um, it's going to open this. This is like a little, like a notepad, like a, te like a text document. You guys want to scroll down until you find, um, it's only a little bit, like a little bit down. I say this right here, resolution size X and then um let's use a confirm resolution size x so these are the only two things you want to mess with don't mess with the y like the resolution size y just make sure that it's set to 1080 so there's 1080 and um make sure it's also set to 1080 right here but yeah what you guys want to do um in this little bit here just do 10 1750 the 1750 and then 1750 and then yeah so once you d change them to there resolution size x and let's use a confirm resolution size x um you guys just press file save so don't do save as you need to file save exit off it and then go back onto the properties by right clicking it go down to attributes and make sure you now tick the this box right here um just press apply right here and press okay um like when you take the attributes what it does it makes sure epic games doesn't try and revert it back to native resolution for you um and yeah it just keeps the changes and doesn't alter your game files from like what you've just changed so just press okay and then you can exit off that now what you guys want to do is now just um alter it for your monitor and your actually actual display so yeah what you guys want to do is go to your control panel or your display control panel so this will this has to be like the control panel for your um actual gpu graphics card and not actually your like um like going into display right here that won't work you can't change it through here so changing this one right here it ain't gonna work you have to because it's a it's not going to be on here like this is a custom resolution and six, six, 1768 is on here but that isn't by 1080 and yeah so it isn't going to be on here because it's not um a, like an it's not a normal resolution so you have to create it so if you go to amd if you have an amd um, graphics card you probably know but you want to just search up amd right here and then go to amd radiant settings but if you guys are pretty nvidia which a lot of you are just um uh, right click anywhere on your desktop and it will say this right here nvidia control panel if not it, you may see this logo down the bottom in your display tray you can click this arrow right here and then go into um it might be here or it'll be right here you can click control panel there or if you still can't find it just literally search up nvidia control panel like so and you'll find it so um so yeah if i do control panel right there apps nvidia um oh here nvidia control panel and if you haven't got the control panel just download it you'll find it on some former site but yeah go into your control panel mine's right here so i'm gonna click it it's gonna open this box right here it's a change resolution what you guys want to do is click customize um then press create custom resolution it's fairly similar for amd as well it says horizontal um pixels you want to change that to 1750 like 1750 like that and where it says vertical lines, make sure that it's set to 1080. It should be um, the same. This basically is acting as your resolution size X. And this is basically resolution size Y. Then you guys want to make sure your refresh rate right here is your monitor's hertz. So make sure it's uh, the refresh rate you have on your monitor. Don't make this any higher than your, your monitor's refresh rate. Like what you've bought it with. Because it can create screen tearing. So your monitor is probably a 60 hertz if you're watching this video. Potentially, I don't know. Or if you're like a, a I don't know. If you're like, you do a lot of gaming, you'll know if it's 144 or if it's like maybe 240 hertz but yeah mine's 144 hertz so i've set that there everything else you can keep the same then you guys want to press test right here all right guys so once you've pressed test it'll um take you onto this right here and just press okay 
and then this is where you want to reselect the resolution you just uh, made so I, you, I want to click on this one right here which says 1750 by 1080 um, just click that make sure it's blue and it will say custom right here make sure the refresh rate is on the highest as it can be 144 and just press apply down here yeah so once you've done that it will show that it's selected and yeah now you've selected it onto your monitor the reason my applications all moves over to the wrong monitor um, that may be an issue when you do it it'll probably switch like these are I don't know why they're they don't need to be what the hell okay everyone everything moved over to the wrong monitor okay guys so just to check that that will set properly you guys can now search up display right here to the bottom where it says change display settings just click that uh yeah you you guys will see here that it does say 1750 by 1080 so you you guys know that you've um you've selected it correctly now once you've done that all you guys gotta do is um launch your fortnite um basically load up your game so once you games launcher or just or just get your Fortnite application mine is right here so yeah i'm gonna load up fortnite and i'm gonna show you guys how this all looks eventually okay guys so we are over on the resolution now loaded into a game um straight off the bat you guys can actually see this the, the fov decrease in this is not bad at all like i think it's about like you lose about 10 to, to maybe even 15 fov which isn't bad at all and like it isn't really an issue you still get the literally almost the exact same horizontal stretch so you're basically getting more of a stretch you get you get more of a stretch and less of an initial um decrease in fov which is what you want like you don't want to be you really you guys really want to be um minimalizing that uh that loss in fov because the more fov and field of view you get um the basically the the better the better it's going to be for you and then obviously you want to be getting um the the most uh stretch like in terms of horizontal view and like how your character models are bigger that that's gonna help him i mean yeah i mean yeah, the, you still sort of get the exact same um, horizontal stretch, so your aim's gonna be improved, etc., etc. And then yeah, the FOV you get like more of an FOV. So this is like I don't know, it doesn't really feel any different at all. Yeah, guys, personally in my opinion, this does um feel a lot smoother to like compared to the other one, which is which is great. It, that that's actually um perfect. So, yeah, if you guys wanna go um ahead and use this resolution, I mean I, I guess you can. Uh, phase phase woven or for when or however you say. Give a link down below. All credit goes to him and I, i'm liking it i do it does feel a lot nicer um compared to the the compared to 1656 by 1080 which is like that that's de definitely um the, the up, up to it that's definitely uh like the the upside to this i don't know guys um you guys can watch um Wolven's video where he um goes a little bit more in depth in this i just want to get it out to you guys i would recommend using this over 1656 it's just personally a lot better if you guys want to um check out Wolven, feel free i will what i'm gonna do now again i've credited him stuff but i have no clips of myself using this resolution besides me right here so if you guys want to um i'm gonna play right now the clips that he got in his video he did get some clips at the end of his video where he showcased his resolution a little bit more and he got like obviously clips you guys can see it in use so yeah i'm gonna play them clips that he got right now and yeah again um they're not my clips i just said uh they're his clips but yeah guys i'll play his clips right now so you guys can see the resolution in use just a little bit more and just see him using it and i'm building so ass right now but um yeah but yeah guys uh that that that's it for me if you guys did enjoy this video watch to the end make sure you guys drop a like on the video subscribe post notifications on so you guys never miss an upload on my channel but yeah guys besides this um that's 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 the end of the video guys again i will keep you guys updated on other stuff like this i've really just butchered this fucking outro but yeah if you guys want to subscribe for more like this make sure you guys do have notifications on if you guys did watch the end make sure you guys drop a comment down below let me know what you guys think about this and drop a like because it really like supports my channel more than you think but yeah um i'll just play the clips right now that Vorven got so yeah here we link down below but yeah guys it's been your boy farfetch and yeah peace Muerto. Queda otro.